Alright, this is my review. Well, actually, I just unboxed it like a few hours, like an hour ago. Um, charging the battery. This is my review of the Driftstar Exceed RC Nitro, uh, not Nitro, Electric 350Z, Nissan 350Z. So, here you go. See, I put the grip tires on there with treads, as you can see. Took the body clips off already. Pat Black Wheels. It just came in the mail. Just made it go. I am gonna be doing some other reviews of the car. I have a 2.4 gigahertz. Radio control, that's why this is a small antenna. Uh, not that I cut it or anything. Let me slide that on. There we go. Nissan 350Z. As you can see, the double tape, it is not really like that. What I. Uh, let's see. See the suspension. Suspension on there. Grip tires. I drove it for like a like a minute. The battery was dead, so I am gonna be changing these settings on the uh, on the uh, car a bit. Yeah, my phone right here. See. Did not cut it. So it's a pretty car, pretty good car. And I hello, hello. Yeah, that was telemark. Uh, telemark. Five forty motor. Powerful from half charge, it's powerful. Uh, back bumper, back plate, plate the bump, block some of the bumps in the back front bumper. It's a good car. I am going to be doing some more reviews of this car. Um, so they should be posted up on YouTube. Yes, it is four wheel drive, shaft driven. Uh, I just got it, so uh, pretty durable, hard plastic. I have to go to football practice in a minute. And the independent suspension. Uh, I really highly suggest that you buy this car. And, okay, and I suggest that you buy this car. It is a pretty, it is a not a pretty good car, but it is a good car. Well built car. Uh the motor uh is really strong. Even on a half charge, it is strong. Like yeah. This is a two point four gigahertz. So I have my yeah, I got it in two point four gigahertz. It comes in regular. Uh it runs me about what was it? It's uh 100. And, no, not 100. With shipping, I got these tires and these rims for the total was 120 dollars and 97 cents. Shaft driven. Uh oh wow! I didn't mean to do that. I'm probably gonna break this before I even get to drive it for sure. Yeah, I'm trying not to do that, but um. So I will be having some more reviews of this car, and I am probably going to get it in a different body soon. So I will have more reviews of this car, and I'm going to show you, I'm going to first try my drift, and I'm going to show you the me drifting of the car. And I'm going to have to change these tires, because these are grip tires made for on-road, so I'm going to have to change these. And I will take you out here to my track that I was building before I even had the car. This is my track.
Uh, I mean, it's not good, but because I realize the car is real big, so <laughs> smart me, smart me. It's uh, so it's a big one tenth. This is the one tenth scale electric uh drift car. Uh, they say drift car, but you can always ride uh with uh grip tires. So I'm gonna upgrade to brush brushless. And I'm gonna show you my airplanes as part of the airplane review. Turn on the light. This is my airplane, half of it. It's broken up. I will fix this. Yeah, they see this is a 540 motor. I pulled out of a vacuum. I had to well solder that on there. This is the motor it comes with. I have no clue what type of motor it is. Uh I don't know, it comes with servos. I was thinking about if I take one of these servos and put it in the RC car, but I don't think it would be strong enough. But um, since it's an airplane, they handle wind. And this thing is a Super Cub uh, Hobby Zone. Here goes the wing. 15-foot uh, wingspan. And uh, I will have some reviews. As soon as I fix that, I'm working on fixing that. So when I fix that, I will post on my YouTube. This is uh, the first video I am gonna put on. So don't, we're, uh, please don't get mad if it's a little bad with the review. But uh, I will have it. So I have my battery charger and stuff. I will be coming up later after I come for football practice, showing you this drift car, the way it drives, and how to read manual and everything. But it is a real good car. I just bought it today, so. So, thanks for viewing, comment, rate, subscribe, and I will have post more videos on this car soon. So, yeah. Alright, thanks.